What is going on guys? Welcome to Brad's Parlay of the Day. Today I got a three-leg parlay for November 14th, 2023. Here at Pitar Drums with free peak videos on anyone, so click that subscribe button. Drop your like, it helps us out a lot. Alright man, currently recording this on Monday, about 5 o'clock p.m. Mountain Time. Watch this uh, Broncos versus Bills game. I'm hoping our parlay that I gave out yesterday hits for this game. I'm feeling pretty damn confident about it. We shall see though. Um, and yeah man, for this parlay... For Tuesday, just got a lot of basketball going on. There's a ton of basketball. I also threw in a college football play in there. So let's get right into it. Let's, let's start off with the college football play. You know, these weekday college football games, when they started happening, like these Tuesday, Wednesday games, like I was really excited. I, I'm, I'm not going to lie, though. I think they've – I'd love to see my record on these weekday college football games because these matching games are are horrific, typically. And I don't know why I keep picking them, but I do. So take this pick um, with a grain of salt. Looking at this matchup between Eastern Michigan versus Akron. What a matchup, guys. It doesn't get much better than Eastern Michigan versus Akron. I don't think it does. Um, but we're going to take Eastern Michigan on the money line here. Take the home team. Both these teams are pretty bad. Let's be real, guys. Both these teams are awful. But I think Akron is substantially worse than e EMU, in my opinion. EMU has beat Akron in the, the last three meetings these teams play together. Akron lost 19-0 last week. Couldn't put up a damn point. Not one point. You had a whole football game to put up points, and you couldn't put up one. Um, Akron, they're also 3-6-1 ATS this season. Akron's just bad. I'm not saying EMU's a good team, but Akron's just bad, and we have EMU at home. Let's just take them on the money line. And look, I know we only got a couple weeks left of these matching games, but if this one loses, I'm never going to bet one of these damn weekday matching games uh, ever again, okay? Let's move on. All right, now we got two NBA games. And two NBA games I'm pretty confident about because I, I chose two stud teams to get wins tomorrow. Um, and for the first one, we're looking at the Nuggets versus the Clippers, and we're going to take the Nuggets on the money line. The Nuggets, they haven't lost a one game on their home court yet this season, and they are home in this one. Uh, which is pretty damn impressive, man. That home court advantage, that elevation, it's a real thing. And coming into Denver and being this Nuggets team is a tough task. And I just don't think the Clippers are going to be the ones who get the job done. Um, they're also 4-2 and two ATS at home. So good ATS records as well. And the Clippers, man, they're a dumpster fire. They're, they're horrific. They're terrible. Um, what other words I could use for the Clippers? Like, they should be good. Paul George, Kawhi, Harden. You would think, like, damn, that's a good, that's a good little team there. No, awful. Uh, the Clippers are 0-5 on the road this season. Haven't won a damn road game. They've lost five straight games in a row. And they didn't even cover in any of those five games. That's how bad they are. So take the Nuggets, guys. Let's not overthink it. Next game, Sixers versus the Pacers. Fun matchup we got here. But give me the Sixers on the money line. Similar to the Nuggets, bro. This Sixers team uh, is the most profitable team in the league right now. They're coming to this one 8-1 uh, against the spread. Uh, six and zero ATS at home, um, just incredible stuff, man. What this Sixers team is doing right now is incredible. If you're a better and you're betting on them, because they're making you money, they're paying your rent. Um, a Tyrese Maxey, dog, absolute dog. Uh, actually, I think uh, the Sixers played the Pacers their last game, and Tyrese Maxey uh, dropped a fifty piece, and now they played this game uh, team again. And, and don't get me wrong, man, I've I've liked what I've seen from the Pacers. I think Halliburton is. Uh, a top player in this league, and he will be for a while. And I've, I've liked the Pacers. I've liked what I've seen from them. But the, the Sixers are just grooving, guys. I can't I can't fade the, the Sixers 8-1 um, and one on the season. And we're not going to take them at home. Seems silly to me. So that's going to do it, man. Let's recap the parlay. Game 1, Eastern Michigan versus Akron. Give me Eastern Michigan on the money line. If you're not going to take... If you're going to, like, not take one of these games, don't take that one. Um... Late two, Nuggets versus Clippers. Give me the Nuggets on the money line. Late three, Pacers versus Sixers. Give me the Pacers on the uh, give me the Sixers on the money line. If you just want a two legger tomorrow, like a safe two legger, you're not going to get crazy odds. Parlay the Sixers and parlay the Nuggets. I'm gonna start doing that because sometimes I make these three leggers and I'll have like a nice two legger that I know is gonna hit. But since like the title of my video is like Brad's parlay of the day, three leg parlay, I gotta add three. So I'm going to start giving you guys, if I like a little two-legger, I'm going to give you that at the end of the video as well. Um, yeah, what else? Oh, yeah, if you want the picks like the best picks, like the most picks that I buy myself personally, go to pitdogs.com, click the premium pick section, or click the link in the description. You'll find all my plays there. Um, I'm up this season in college basketball, the NFL, and the NBA. 
um, statistically, units wise, uh, we're up in all three of those sports, and that's the three sports we got going on right now. So if you are interested in premium picks, man, it's a good time to hop on. Um, if you want to learn more about me, check out some more free picks, some of my content. You can follow me on Instagram at Brad, Brad wins best, but most importantly, subscribe to Pit Talks because all we want to do is help you guys win some money. I'll catch you guys tomorrow.